Hello and welcome back. Hope you are taking very good care of yourself. Do you know why we are here today? Yes, you are right to listen to an interesting new story. This story is about a donkey whose name is Alpha. Alpha used to stay in Alabama, United States of America. There were huge farmlands spread across the mountains and in these farmlands there were a lot of farm animals. You know farm animals, right? Chickens, horses, pigs, cows, sheep, goat and donkey. Donkey is also a farm animal. So Alpha used to stay with all other farm animals in the farmlands of Alabama. Alpha the donkey was very hard working. Do you know how donkeys are used as farm animals or how they help in farming? Let's find out what all Alpha used to do in these farmlands. So donkeys are used in transportation. Transportation means to carry something from one place to another. So Alpha used to transport people, goods or crops from one town to another. Alpha used to also carry water from one area to another where people used to not find water easily. So can you imagine how these donkeys carry so much weight? They carry these weights on their back because they are very strong. They are able to carry a lot of weight on their back and not only this, they are able to carry this weight for a very long distance. They never get tired. They are very, very strong. The so donkeys, they pull the plow and the cart and that is how they help the farmers while farming. Do you know what else donkeys do in the farmlands? Donkeys are also used as companion animals. Means they are very good friends. We can be friends with the donkeys. So donkeys can be very good pets as well. And sometimes small kids take ride of these donkeys. Did you ever take a donkey ride? They also are guard animals. Guarding means protecting. Alpha used to protect sheep and goats from other predators, from other wild cats or wolves. When sheep and goats used to climb at the top of the mountain to eat the green grass, the donkeys surround these animals and protect them from other wild animals. So these other wild animals don't attack the sheep and the goats and eat them. So basically, the donkeys are so strong that they can fight these other wild animals. So now you know what all Alpha the donkey used to do. Don't you think how intelligent, smart and amazing Alpha the donkey was? But there was one weird thing because of which Alpha the donkey was never happy. He always felt sad and he always felt that there is something less which he is doing and he has to do more and more and he kept on pushing himself. Do you know what that thing was? He had a very bad habit of comparing himself with everyone else. So Alpha the donkey kept on comparing himself with other farm animals. One day what happened? Alpha... The donkey, he went to the chicken and he told the chicken, Chicken, what do you think? Are you more useful? What do you think? Do you work more than me or I work more than you? The chicken said, Alpha, why are we having this discussion? We cannot compare our work. Your work is different and my work is different. So the donkey said, let it be. You tell me if you work more or I work more. Because I believe being a chicken, you work very less. But I'm a donkey and I work a lot. So you see what Alpha was doing here? Alpha was comparing himself with a chicken. And he was trying to tell the chicken that chicken, you are not doing lots of work in the farms. Only I am doing lots of work in the farms. But the chicken said, Donkey, you know, this comparisons are not good. We should never compare ourselves with anyone. 
बिकॉज ईच एंड एवरीबडी इज डिफरेंट एंड स्पेशल इन देर ओन वे सो एल्फर द डोंकी सेड ओके लेट मी आस्क यू वन क्वेश्चन चिकन लाइक हाउ आई कैरी हैवी लगेज एंड ट्रेवल फ्रॉम वन टाउन टू अनदर Will you be able to carry such heavy luggage on your back and travel from one town to another, Chicken? Chicken got confused for a moment, and Chicken asked Alpha, "But do you know what chickens do? Chickens eat the insects from the farmland and keep the farmland free from insects, so that these insects don't destroy the crops later. That is why chickens are also called farmers' best friends." Can you do that, donkey? So the donkey kept quiet and he left. But even after going home, he was happy that he had compared himself with a chicken. All the farm animals knew that Alpha had a very bad habit of comparing himself with others. So chicken shared this incident with all the other farm animals. The next day, Alpha went to a cow, and Alpha told the cow, "Cow." Do you think you are stronger than me? I believe that I am more stronger than you. That is why I am able to pull the cart very nicely while farming. So the cow said, "Donkey, why are you comparing again? It's not good to compare. You know, everyone is special and everyone is unique and different. We all have different things to do." It's not at all right to compare yourself with others. So why are you comparing yourself with me, donkey? So donkey said, "Whatever. You tell me. Can you pull the cart much better than me, cow?" So cow took a pause and cow said, "My manure, that is cow dung, is used for n number of purposes. One of the purpose is." the cow dung is dried and made into a circle and when you burn it because of the flames human beings and animals are protected from dangerous poisonous mosquitoes so i save people's life you see the donkey was taken aback he said let it be and he walked away from there but even after going home he was happy that he had compared himself with the cow again all the farm animals got to know that donkey has compared himself with the cow so all the farm animals decided that next time if the donkey is comparing himself with any one of them they will teach him a very good lesson so one fine day again the donkey went to the horse and he told the horse horse do you think you are more useful in farm lands or i am i feel i do lots of work than you and you perform very less activities so i am more useful than you the horse smiled the horse knew that this time they had to teach a very good lesson to the donkey so that he does not compare himself with anybody else so the horse told the donkey donkey you are right you are comparing yourself with me and this time i realize that actually you are better than me so donkey why don't you become a horse for one day and show me what all i can do the donkey smiled and he said did you see how correct i was that is why i keep on comparing myself with everybody because i know i am the best donkey decided to behave like a horse one day the donkey had to run a race like a horse so the horse told the donkey okay so now come you said you can do things better than me so come on there is a race with other horses you come to the race and you have to take 10 rounds of the ground and the animal who comes first after taking 10 rounds is the winner since you are the best and you know that you have compared yourself with everybody and you have found out that you are the best so you can participate and run like a horse the donkey was very happy he said it is such a simple task i can do it very easily he smiled all the farm animals was sitting in the podium and waiting for the match to start everybody cheered and the race started 
all the horses started running. The donkey also gave his best and he started running. You remember I had told you how hardworking and intelligent Alpha the donkey was in the beginning. That is why he was able to run very fast, very fast. But after two rounds, Alpha the donkey started feeling very tired. His heart started beating very fast. He started feeling dizzy in the middle of the race. All the other horses were running continuously and they were completing their rounds. But Alpha the donkey could not run anymore. He stood at one place. For a moment he looked up and he fainted and fell on the ground. As soon as he fell on the ground, the race was stopped with a red flag. The other farm animals came down. They were worried for Alpha. They started to wake him up. They put water on his face. And finally, Alpha the donkey opened his eyes. He looked around. He saw the chicken, the cow and the horse next to him. He told them, Friends, I understand. It was a very big mistake that I compared myself with all of you. Now I know that every animal, every person, every human being is very special and unique and different. We all are good in different things and we should always try to become better in those things and not try to compare ourselves with anybody else. After the race was completed, everybody went home and all the farm animals sat together and they were talking to Alpha, the donkey and they told the donkey, donkey, do you know how important you are? Because of your sharp memory, you are able to travel from one town to another. Because of your strong legs, you are able to climb up high on the mountain with such sharp curves that if a smallest mistake is made, you will fall in the valley. But you are so alert that you are able to do it so easily. We adore that donkey. Listening to all these things, the donkey felt really very happy. He understood that comparison was a wrong thing to do. Everybody is different and each and everybody is very, very special. We should always keep our attention to ourselves. Look into our goods and bads and try to be a better, better person every day. Now, it's time for an interesting fact about donkeys. Do you know when donkeys look down, they see all four legs. The other interesting fact is, the donkeys have longer ears. And these long ears help them feel cool most of the time. Donkeys have a very sharp memory. They can memorize a road. They can memorize a person's face. So next time, if you see a donkey in any of the donkey farm, try to have a very nice conversation with the donkey. And I'm 100% sure the donkey will remember you next time. And I hope you understand how dangerous comparison is. So let's not compare ourselves. Let's not compare any of our things. Be happy and take care of yourself. And we will meet in the next story. Thank you. Bye-bye.